Lonnie Plays Games. I'm your host Lonnie Play and I'd like to thank you for taking just a few moments out of your day to view my video. Let's take a look at this week's gaming news. Square Enix has announced their next expansion for their massively multiplayer online role-playing game Final Fantasy XIV. Endwalker, as it has been titled, will be released on the 23rd of November 2021. Along with a new story, the expansion will include the Sage and Reaper classes, a Healer and High Damage Per Second class respectively. Additionally, those who pre-order the expansion will get to play it a whole four days earlier on the 19th of November. Since its launch just over a week ago, Resident Evil 8 has already sold over 3 million copies worldwide. Bringing the shipment total for the whole franchise to in excess of 100 million units. In other Resident Evil Village news, Dutch director Richard Rapost has accused Capcom of copying one of the monster designs from his 2013 film Frankenstein's Army. Rapost stated that it's a crazy monster movie filled with my own creature designs, one of which has been used completely without authorization or credit in the newest Resident Evil game. In an interview with Eurogamer, the director points out that the boss, Sturm, is even killed in the same manner as the unnamed creature from his film. Both Nintendo and Sony have reported that their Switch and PS5 consoles respectively are still in short supply, with the latter stating that they expect the shortages to continue into 2022. A major factor is global shortages of semiconductors, which are used in almost all computing devices. But on the bright side, you can now get the PS5's DualSense controller in red or black. And finally, a couple of highlights from the mini games that are on sale this weekend through Steam. The first game I will be mentioning is Team 17's Beyond Eyes, which originally came out in August of 2015. Normally £9.99 here in the UK and $14.99 in the United States, Steam is currently offering a whopping 80% off, leaving you to pay only £1.99 here in the UK and only $2.99 in the United States. Beyond Eyes tells the story of Ray, a young girl who hardly ever leaves her home after an accident left her both blind and severely traumatized. She now fears loud noises and public spaces. However, when her cat, Nanny, goes missing, she has to summon all of her courage in order to find her. And now for, in my eyes, the piece de resistance. I've been wanting to play a Sherlock Holmes game for a while now, but haven't really known where to start and, you know, was umming and ahhing at some of the prices as well. If, like me, you've been dreaming to become the master of deductive reasoning, then fear not. For the rest of this weekend, Steam has knocked an amazing 90% off of the price for Sherlock Holmes, The Devil's Daughter. Normally selling for $9.99 in the US and £7.99 in the UK, you can currently get it for $1 or 80 pence, respectively. In The Devil's Daughter, you will get to take Sherlock Holmes through several cases where actions and deductions will affect the rest of the story for better or for worse. And that's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed this gaming news update, then please do like and leave a comment to help with the YouTube algorithm. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already and ring the notification bell so you can stay up to date with my latest content. Please do check out my main channel, which I will link here also at youtube.com forward slash c forward slash limey play where i routinely destroy flat earthers and occasionally other conspiracies as well as making fun of karens and random other things if you would like to support my channels you can join my patreon or make a one-time donation through paypal also please don't forget to visit my discord server and hang out with us all there links to all of that and more are in the description thank you again so much for watching my video as always i've been limey play take care of each other and stay safe Thank you.